Aida Vega. I'm the director of Adult Primary Care Services at Mount Sinai Medical Center. I always enjoyed science. For me, that was always the best part of school. Early in my medical career, I felt I had to prove myself. It wasn't always because I was a woman, it was because I was a woman and because I was Hispanic. When I started my career in 1983, I had no role models. My encouragement was my mother, and she was not a doctor. She worked in a factory and was very interested in making sure that her children had a better life than she did, and also that her children became educated. Even though there have been challenges, I've been able to overcome those challenges in my career. I think things have gotten much better. And in many ways, it's more that there's an awareness that women have to be mentored in a certain, a different way because there may not be the opportunities initially. I think there's more of an acceptance of having women in the workplace and Hispanics in the workplace. At Mount Sinai, for instance, if you walk into a room, if you go into a program, it feels very comfortable, very comforting, and I think most people are welcoming in every way. As a mentor, you always draw up on your own personal experience. So definitely, you try to be an inspiration. That's probably the most important, is to understand that vision and the dream that that person has and be able to encourage that. What I usually tell my, my female faculty or young medical students who come to see me is that you have to really prioritize and you have to see what's important to you in your life at a certain point in time. It's fluid and you have to address it along the way depending on the situations that arise. Mm -hmm.